Welcome to this video, guys. I have this sample code here that uses pandas. But if I try to run this, I get this error that says no module named pandas. I'm running this inside from, uh, I'm running this from VS Code. You can also run this from terminal if you are running it that way. And still you'll get the same error. Okay. So no matter how you run it, you're still getting the same error because pandas is not installed on your system. So you can easily install pandas by running this command. Now you can run this from your terminal or your command prompt or from your editor, wherever you are uh, using your uh, project from. So I'll just type python dash m pip install pandas and this will install pandas system wide. This error will be gone, but this is not a good practice because this will install pandas globally. That means the same pandas version will be used for all your projects. Now, a good practice is to use virtual environments so that you can isolate your project dependencies and you can just install a specific version of pandas for a specific project. Let's wait till this is finished and then I'll show you how you can install pandas in virtual environment for your specific project. Once pandas installed, you will see that warning is gone and now you can run uh, your code simply like this and that pandas error will be gone. But how to install pandas in virtual environment, okay? So I already have a virtual environment here. Let me first delete it. Okay, now I'm running these commands from within the terminal of VS Code. You can run it from command prompt or terminal. So first let's create a virtual environment. So the command is python -m -v -e -n -v and then give any name to your virtual environment. I'll just call it my venv, hit enter, and this virtual environment will be created. As you can see, virtual environment is created and the process is not yet finished. Let's wait till this is finished. After the virtual environment is created successfully, we need to activate the virtual environment so that we can install dependencies inside that virtual environment. Okay, so to activate it, just enter this command that write the name of the virtual environment that you have just created. Now make sure you are inside the current directory. Otherwise, this will not be found. Okay, so venv and then scripts and then activate. This would activate virtual environment or your system in Windows. If you are on Mac or Linux, the command is source and then your virtual environment name and then bin and then activate. Okay, once virtual environment is activated, you should see the virtual environment name in front of your project directory. Now let's install pandas, pip install pandas, and this time pandas will be installed inside this virtual environment. Again, let's wait till this is finished. Once the installation is complete, now you can run this Python file simply just by doing python main.py and it will be using pandas from this virtual environment. Now whenever you are using virtual environment, make sure you have activated it so that you can install uh, dependencies in this virtual environment and that when you type python you will use python from this virtual environment so this is how you can install pandas in windows 11 if you have any questions let me know in the comments below